hi friends welcome back to live web tutorial with laravel 8 so today we will going to show you a real magic of liveware here we will not write any single js code here we will only use the liveware we will do a simple calculation with the from okay so first we will create a two text box and will provide the number on that and it will result the sum of two number without replacing the page without the help of single js or ajax code that's cool so let's start so first create a library component so go to the terminal php artisan make library and my component name is simple calculation okay just enter this so the component created and a class file and view file also created so if you go to the project directory inside the app http library will get the simple calculation component class file and here is the render function by default when you create any component will get this function and it will call a blade file that is the view file of this component that is simple calculation so just go to the resource inside the resource we have views library and simple calculation dot blade dot php so this is the component blade file so here we will create a simple from so write from and inside this from we will create to text box that is input type text and the name is suppose num1 that is for number one so right here first number and create another text box that is for second number okay so write here second number and write the name that is num2 that's cool and here we will create a button and the type equal to submit so just write submit and close the button and here the label is add okay so just create routes to call this class file so that we can see this just go to the routes inside the routes we have web.php okay so first we need to call this simple calculation class file from the route so use the namespace that is app http library and after that the name of the class it is simple calculation okay just write it here and create a link that is route colon colon get so here i'm using the get request so i'm writing the get and here write a simple calculation okay and the class name colon colon plus okay so if we go to this link we can see this from so before that we need to start the server so just go to the terminal and write php artisan serve okay the starting laravel development server so just go to this link so here we can see the two number that is first number and the second number okay so now it is the submit button so if we click on this link so basically it is refreshing and it's submitting with the num1 and num2 so here we are using the ajax request so we don't need to submit this so when you click on this add button we will get the output here so basically we will enter some value here and enter some value in second number and click on this button we will show the output okay so just remove this and click refresh okay so now go to the class file so here is the class file that is simple calculation okay so for num1 we will create a property that is public dollar num1 and we will create another that is public 
dollar num2 and another one that is sum that is public dollar sum basically this will be the result so we will add num1 and num2 and store those result into the sum okay so by default if we not have any value in num1 and num2 the result will be zero so i am setting just default number for sum okay so now let's create a function for calculation so write public function suppose the function name is calculate okay so here just simple just use the property so this sum equal to dollar this num1 plus dollar this num2 that's simple okay we know that inside the class file whichever we have a variables we can directly access from this view file so just print the result here okay so basically dollar sum is the resulted output so just write here beer okay so i just want to display in the new line so just write the result so write the result equal to dollar sum okay so just right here now the main things we have left that is we need to bind those things into the property so just here write the where model so here the model is num1 and same things just copy from previous and paste it here and change the where model that is num2 okay and when we click on the submit button basically we need to write where submit okay so when we submit we will call which function we have created this function that is calculate so just write it here that's simple okay now one thing if we click on the submit button basically it will submitting okay i don't want to submit but we want to see the result so how can we do this so we need to prevent the submission default okay so just write prevent here so it will not submit the actual page that means it will not refresh the page but we can see the output so very simple so just go to the browser and refresh this okay so here the result is zero because i am adding the default value is zero so now if we pass the value suppose the first number is 10 and second number is 20 okay so we will just click on add so we can see the 30 that is cool very simple we are not using any j score we are not using any ajax code but still we can get the access of method using the library that's magic so now change the number so right here the 30 and here i'm writing 5 so click on add so it's 35 so this is very interesting and you can see how simply we can use those things with the library actions so basically from this video we can see how to bind a model with the properties and how to use the submit okay so next day we will going to show you the complete library life cycle that is life cycle of library hooks okay so don't miss this video if you have any queries about this video please comment in the below comment section and please like and subscribe this channel for upcoming video thanks for watching this video bye bye